morning, good evening, good afternoon. How are you guys doing? So, I was cleaning a little bit before starting recording. Also, Claiming good god. Uh what was it saying? Oh right. Oh so I tinkered with my ten mil a little Just checking if he was on the, the right side. I got the mods I was considering getting. As uh, you can see. Much better. As I live and breathe. Hello, Codzert. Oh, it's it's really you. <laughs> Codsworth, what happened to the world? The world, Mum. Well, besides our geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills, I'm afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Sir back. Where is your better half, by the by? Yeah, about that. They... They killed him. Oh, Mum, these things you're saying, these terrible things, are... I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this, this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or, or perhaps charades. Oh, Sean does so love that game. <laughs> is, is the lad uh, with you? Uh... Sean's been kidnapped. But I'm gonna find him. <clears throat> I'm gonna get my baby back. It's worse than I thought. Mm -hmm. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. 200 years? 200 years? What? Are you... A bit over 210, actually, Mum. Give or take a little for the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. That means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. You must be famished. You okay, buddy? Codsworth, you're acting a little weird. What's wrong? I... I... Uh, Mom, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no 
want to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> Poor fella. And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. <laughs> and the car, the car, how, how do you polish rust? rust? Stay with me, pal. Focus. I'm afraid I don't know anything, Mum. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were, were dead. Well, I, Nate is. I did find this hollow tape. I believe Sir was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. What's on it? A hollow tape? What's on it? I believe it's a private message for you. My etiquette protocols would not permit me to play it for myself. Any standard holotape reading device should be able to play it back. Oh, like that pip boy on your arm. That should work brilliantly. <laughs> now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? Sir and young Sean may turn up yet. Have you seen anything dangerous? Have you seen anything dangerous? Oh, just the usual, Mum. Pesky neighborhood dogs and mosquitoes. Shall I investigate? Sure, All lead right. the way. Lead the way. Proud to serve, Mum. <laughs> yeah, but I won't join him. Hell yeah. I already got the book though. I don't remember which stat I got though. But... I trust everyone's still alive. You know what? Miss Beatrice, your your family isn't here either. Oh, thanks for trying. Thanks for trying, Codsworth. You can't keep up, Mum. What about the city? Concord is nearby, and, well, the people there have only shot at me a few times. <laughs> there are still people alive in Concord? There are still people alive in Concord? Yes, although they're a bit rough. You remember the way? Just across the southern footbridge, out of the neighborhood, and past the red rocket station. I shall remain here and secure the home front. Yeah, you do that. I don't wanna eat a red roach though, but... oh well. It will have to do... Need to remember this fucking half not kill Whoa 
5k. Should I? would make a rifle but uh oh well like six and something am right now I really should be sleeping, it's a fucking Sunday, but oh, whatever. Three oh eight. That's a problem. Hey, doggy meat. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? You want to come with me, pal? Okay, then. Let's stick together. Do I want to kill those more rats now? What is it, boy? When I'm cleaning shit like this, I would just like
I would just cut stuff or I don't know maybe I will speed up I'm actually going back to sanctuary just so I can start this shit and fill my bottles Okay, maybe that... Oh, right. Maybe the... Bagger stash mod is a little broken. Oh, let me see if I can. Oh, nice. Patches Black And Black uh, Dog meat? Over here. <laughs> hey. Nice. Now you can you can carry more shit for me? And I completely forgot about this thing. Later done.
I also forgot the mod that uh, that give my bottles back when I I drink water. Oh well. Conquer, do we go? Sorry for being awfully quiet, but... I guess I will remove the this mod. Won't be able to pick this. Oh, right. Dog meat, please come here. Hey. God, this was a thing. to level up though
missed this one. Yep. Another mod that I completely forgot. Bingo. The marmite one. Really got what I wanted, so it's cruel those more rats. Is it? The bags. Fuck. Pressing at five, like, oh well. This mod, oh, okay. And that one I can. That's so. Uh... Move here.
Hey, up here, on the balcony. I've got a group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, please! Hey, here. <laughs> I know lead lead or lead huh anyway I know the that perk is more useful but uh I have my reasons. Nice. Give me a moment. Twenty minutes later. Just so you guys know, I removed the mod, but I won't get rid of my caps. Fucking fog though. Like, bruh. You gotta love the Bethesda environment instead of Envir... Mm. Yes. 
their story the storytelling you know Oh fuck, I forgot the meat mod again. Oh well. I use it more as a way to, to grind XP while cooking anyway, so that's okay. It's not like I'm gonna starve or anything. Yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, young. Try maybe? No. Uh, hope it. Fuck. Just want the XP, I don't really care. I'm in. Nice. Jesus. Sweet.
Much, much better. I mean, not really, but in a way it is. Like we're supposed to. What are you, deaf? Somebody's out there shooting the place up. I ain't sitting around waiting to die. I swear to God, you make a move for that exit, and I'll cut you myself. Shut your mouth, and we'll never get the drop on this bitch. God, let me just Shit to deal with. You hear that? I gotta go take a little walk. But I'll be back and you'll be dead. <laughs> Shit. Fuck. No need to be that <laughs> I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minutemen. Huh. <laughs> um, oh, that ain't it. Back in time? Minutemen? So now I'm traveling backward in time. Protect the people at a minute's notice. That was the idea. So I joined up, wanted to make a difference. And I did, <sighs> nope. but things fell apart. Now it looks like I'm the last Minuteman left standing. <sighs> The world's changed so much. None of this makes sense. You all right? Listen, we need your help. And then maybe we can help you, huh? What brought you out here? Looking for an infant boy. He's been kidnapped. Yours or tracking for someone else? Used to be a lot of families in this group. More than a few missing relatives. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. First it was the ghouls in Lexington, and now this mess. Ghouls? Ghouls? What are ghouls? Wow. Maybe. You really aren't from around here, are you? Nope. Ghouls are... 
the radiated people. Most are just like you and me. They look pretty messed up and live for a long time, uh, that ain't but it. they're still just people. The ones I'm talking about are different. The radiations rotted their brains, made them feral. God damn it. They'll rip you apart just as soon as look at you. Anyway, we figured Conquer would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But, well, we do have one idea. Will it be enough, though? Will it be enough to stop those maniacs? Sturgis, tell her. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. I love his Might accent. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. What makes that power armor so special? A West Tech internalized servo system, that's what! Inside that baby, super is the new what norm. What happens to my subtitles? Be stronger, tougher, resistant to rads, and... Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? Huh. Could work. It'll work, provided we can reactivate the suit. It's totally out of juice. Probably has been for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. So what's the solution? What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement. Locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. I already have it. Actually, I already grabbed the fusion core. We're set. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. Holy fuck. Uh, point one, point five, point one, point five, point six, point three, point five. Okay. brought to us so he's your dog ah uh, he ain't my dog no sir dog meat he's what you call his own man you can't own a free spirit like that but he chooses his friends and sticks with them he'll stay by you now I saw it you saw, you saw it? it? It's the Kems, kid. They give old Mama Murphy the sight. Been that way for as long as I can remember. Oh boy, that's it. I'm out of here. All right. I sometimes forget the folks ain't used to with. Don't want to be rude with sight. her, but. You go on. I actually like Mama Murphy. I really hope you guys can hear my green parents talking. Anyways. Da -da -da -da. 
Personal log. United States Army Staff Sergeant Thanks. Michael Daly. This past Saturday, October 23rd, one day after that, Flaherty and Kanawa were shot by some scared, desperate survivors. I guess I could. Oh well. Okay, where's the death claw? There it is. Really? Uh -oh. I need that one. So Come on Got it You know, I just wish my hood would stay white, but uh, 
Easy mama. Oh well. You okay? I'm That nice. was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you're on our side. Hold on, I mean a door. The feeling's mutual, Preston. You can never have too many friends. Not in the Commonwealth. Listen, when we first met, you asked about the Minutemen. One thing you should know about us, we help out our friends. So here, for everything you've done, thank you. I didn't do it for the money. Hey, sorry. I'm used to everyone being Are there in for themselves. You know, you remind me of my friends. The other men and men. The ones who gave their lives for something bigger than themselves. You should come with us to Sanctuary. We could use the help. What would I need to do? You'd need to stay strong like you've been. Because there's more to your destiny. I've seen it. And I know your pain. Okay, I don't want to be... An asshole with her. <laughs> but it's tempting. Because I already know all the other answers except this one, but... Okay, I'm listening. You are a woman out of time, out of hope, but all is not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. I'm listening. Look, kid, I know how I sound. The sight, it's weird. And it ain't always clear. But your son's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. What's in Diamond City? Is Sean there? Look, kid. I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The sight will paint a clearer picture. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Oh, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the sight. And our new friend here, she's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama you. Murphy saw it? It can oh, hardly hold turn on, out hold any on. worse than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy... Got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June, it's time to go. Oh, okay. So, this will do for this episode. When next we come back, I will be in a. Oops. I will be in a sanctuary, probably, and I will see what I'm gonna do from there. Anyways, stay safe, stay hydrated, take care of each other, and I see you all on a on the next one. 
taking shots at the enemy I'm gonna make it to the top, leave a legacy If I got something to say, you better let me speak Turn it up a new degree, bitch, you ain't seen anything I pop off with the new rock, a legend